Hello everyone. This is Shobhana Kumar Muragavan um, uh, from the batch of 1991 uh, ex Nalini. And um, I feel enormously privileged to pay this tribute to Venkatachalam sir. Um, I'm going to depart a little from the usual narrative of him being a teacher because um, growing up as the uh, daughter of one of the staff members uh, Jiragavan and Neela uh, on campus in Lawrence School allowed uh, my gave my brother and me the enormous privilege of meeting all faculty members and growing to love and regard them as extended family. Um, over the course of my father's long stint at Lawrence, he had the opportunity to go on several conferences with Mr. Venkatachalam and Appa always brought back these warm stories of how um, once both of them traveled to Delhi for an international conference on education and they were hosted in Mr. Venkatachalam's sister's house. Um, so that's a very fond memory but there is one memory that I want to share with all of you. I never had the privilege of being taught by Sir, um, so business studies. Um, I, I chose science instead. Um, it's a question that I ask why even all these years later. But um, this very special memory that I want to share goes back to 1995 when my parents were shopping for my trousseau. So there was a very special requirement um, as per custom, the Trishur Velaka that needed to be um, that needed to accompany me to my marital home. And my parents were a little unfamiliar with the custom and uh, without hesitation, they um, asked uh, Mr. Venkatachalam and auntie to help uh, them with this predicament. And I still remember um, this was the days before email hit us, before uh, the cell phone hit us. Uh, there was an STD call that Sir placed from Trishur to ask my parents permission to buy a particular size and they brought it back very carefully because it was made of bronze and it was uh, prone to uh, breaking very easily. They brought it back home ever so carefully, gift wrapped it and gave it to me for my wedding. Today on all special occasions when I light that lamp, I send a special prayer for Sir and his family. Um, why, I, why I talk about this is because um, Going the extra mile is something that has always been very natural for sir and for ma'am. And um, just want to say that this enormous gesture is um, so carefully treasured and remembered and loved by my family all these years later. I wish sir and ma'am the very, very best for um, a long, healthy and happy and peaceful life. Thank you very much, OL community, for giving me this opportunity. Thank you. Hi, good evening. Thanks for giving me the opportunity to share my experience in Lawrence School with OILs through the OIL Assembly platform. My professional journey through the corridors of the school was for about 35 years. 
14 years are gone by after my retirement from the school in 2006. Memories are getting faded in me due to aging. Now, sitting back at home, I still take pride to be an ex-staff of this great institution for such a long period of three and a half decades, to speak precisely from 1971 to 2006. From the post of master to teach commerce, I was given the opportunity to serve the institution in all possible posts in succession, such as house tutor, house master, HOD, master in charge of junior school, bursar, DHM, and HM for a short spell of time, of course, in an officiating capacity. When I sit back and unwind my memory record, many exciting incidents flash through my mind. To share a few of them, the outward bound camps, weekend trekking through hills, taking children for social service under the interact club activities, organizing onum entertainment by staff for children, taking senior children to Uti golf course for practice, etc. All these are embedded in me as sweet memories. I could learn a bit of sculpting and painting with the kids during my free time, which I consider, continue to try even now. Laurentians enjoy playing pranks with tech teachers. I was a target in many occasions. I vividly remember one incident when they fooled me badly on an all fools day. Oils of senior Arvalli house may recollect that incident. Of course, they especially girls sometimes were very shrewd to test our talent. This could be very evident when they suggested my name to Raji Menon to approach me for a short role in a song in his film Minsar Kenavu while shooting in the senior school. I had no choice but to accept it and experience a bit of acting. Many oils keep in touch with me and I am happy to know their involvement in improving the infrastructure of the school. Hats off to the oil association for their efforts. Also it is heartening to note that the school is maintaining a high standard of performance in every sphere. I am hopeful that the normal routine will be reinstated at an early date once the school reopens after the COVID lockdown and the campus will be as vibrant as it used to be. Hoping to see you at Founders next year. Bye. Good evening, everybody. First of all, let me congratulate the OLA, the Old Laurentians Association, to have thought of this brilliant idea of holding an assembly on the second Saturday of every month to get the feeling of a reunion which in turn gives an opportunity to share the nostalgic memories among the fellow members. The organizers of the assembly, no doubt, are trying their level best to include a variety of events, the highlight being remembering and requesting the old teachers to present themselves physically and address them, which in turn creates a positive wave in the minds of the teacher and the taught. Well, as most of my students are aware of, my association with Lovedale was just a design. My entry was that of a honeymooner by virtue of marrying the then Prince Charming your favorite PRV in the summer of 1975. This turned out to be a long stint till I withdrew myself to settle at Coimbatore in 2008. These 33 years were power packed with comedies, tragedies, tragic comedies, historicals and the like to make me a Shakespeare. It was a very rewarding experience to be a teacher working under half a dozen heads, starting with Mr. Vyas, Mr. Bhatnagar, Mr. Dev Lahiri, Mr. Harshwal, Mr. Ramesh and Mr. Prasad. Besides being an amiable consort of a housemaster, master in charge, bursar, the acting deputy headmaster and the headmaster. The classroom experiences were manifold. One moment the headmaster comes to the classroom just to compliment you on the excellent assembly speech you had made in the morning. The next moment 
you struggle in the classroom to give a reading test to one of the most non-cooperative pupils. I had enjoyed every moment of it so much that I have enough and more to recollect in this retired life, especially students and the support staff without whom it would not have been as thrilling and fulfilling as it seems to be now. Lovedale cannot be erased out of our minds, nor the history of Lovedale be complete without the Winkies. We thank God Almighty to have given our children Vinod and Divya an opportunity to grow up in Lovedale during their formative years, which in turn has helped them settle well in life, giving the confidence to face life with all its perplexities. Long live Lawrence, long live the OLA, Jai Hind.